Hi, today we're going to create our own passport photos. There is a um, photo tool on uh, the U.S. Uh, passport site. You can search for U.S. passport photo tool. Um, it's self-explanatory on how to use this tool. You choose your photo, you crop it, and then you uh, save it. Um, you can find a lot of my tips on the website thinkbacon.jimdo.com. I'll reference that site later on. But one of the things that you may find is that your uh, picture doesn't have a white background. You really need a white background. If you don't, it may be rejected. So I use a tool, free tool called uh, GIMP, G-I-M-P. You can search and find that site. I have links to that site as well on my site. Um, what I need, what you need to do is go into the uh, um, colors menu, select levels, and there's a, a button for um, auto, or you can try, the best thing to use is pick a white point, and you use that tool to create um, a white background. When you want to save the file, you actually need to export it. So you do File Export. You choose 100% um, quality to get the best image saved. Now I have to create um, uh, another image that will contain this photo and, and actually three other photos because I want to create a 4x4 four four photo. I'll have four two by two images. Uh, the government requires a two by two image for your photo. Um, so we need to create an image and the image has to be, um, in this case, I'm going to create the four by four and I have to go into the advanced options and I select an X resolution of 300, a Y resolution of 300 and then I open with, do open with layers, select my photo. You can see here I selected two photos. I did it twice, open with layers twice. I moved as a move tool to move the pictures around. And then I will export the 4x4 four four photo with 100% quality. And there we are. Um, you can could fit four pictures in that 4x4 four four photo, export it, save it, upload it to a site like Walmart Photos um, site, and you print it out. Easy as that.